Well, Milton has been gone over 24 hours. And look how this water is raging out of this. The uh, spillway from the uh, reservoir here. Edward Better Reservoir. That they're at. And I've never seen them like this before. Yeah, all up in there. The whole thing. And there's a bridge down there that goes under. The bridge is still very safe, looks like. But it's a way, way, way above flood stage, even. This is the worst. Biggest rain this area has ever seen, I think. And over here, the water here is within about six feet at the top here. As normally it means around 12, 15 feet. And out here, where you see all these uh, bars running around, that's the shape of a, uh, out there at the, uh, where you see the Kind of a squared off oblong shaped bar. There's a big platform underneath that. And it's, I keep, I don't know how far underwater that thing is, but it must be five, six feet underwater, at least. There you have it. Never met this much water in this day of the reservoir before. Ever since it's been built back on uh, the 1980s, I believe it was. And the I believe that's even it's even torn down that fence that was uh, across the across that water tried to keep people out. Now it's going to talk it down in the water a good ways. This is it. This is near the top of the uh, in fact the north side of the dam. Edward Miller Reservoir. And as you can see, the water is way up. And this here, I don't know what's going on, but this is supposed to be a, a emergency valve. If the water gets 
uh, up to that ground there that just go on under the road. And but here they've got got about four pumps pumping the water out of the lake. The only thing I could figure is they wanted to keep it from tearing the road up over here. And this is their way of doing it. Apparently. Oh, I don't know. You know as much about it as I do. But they've got a lot of water pumping out of there. So, maybe that's what's happening. The only thing I can figure. size these uh, holes are going out there. Yeah, here's the north end of the lake. And you can see that uh, where the water level is now. And uh, You see down there. <clears throat> you guys know anything about the north end of the dam here? This is how it looks now. Can't believe the water's this high, but it's going down. North end of the Edward Miller Dam on Turk Creek Road. And this is how high the water is. After Milton. This is the Durant Wedding Chapel. The one's on the left of it. As you can see, pretty well for the hurting on this side. Been a wind there for a while. Got that folks. Red Wedding Chapel. On and up and up. Here's a lake from the top of the old boat ramp. Here you can see water here where when it's normal. You can't see water at all. But this is right after the storm. And you can see it. It's right down to the bottom of the ramp. And right down. No tell you how much higher than this thing really got. Way above flood stage, I'm sure.